Blockchain technology has offered a decentralized approach to business and financial exploits. It has continued to grow more and more popular over the years with the emergence of investment options such as cryptocurrencies and NFTs. These blockchains make use of the node technology in their operations. Blockchain nodes store a complete copy of the distributed ledger and are responsible for the reliability of the stored data. This distributed ledger can be viewed real-time by every member of the blockchain, making it almost impossible to gain control of the blockchain. However, there's a little problem. The process of running and maintaining blockchain nodes has a bunch of technical issues. It is also very time-consuming and financially draining. This has made it really difficult for individuals to develop and manage their own nodes, and so Nodes as a Service has come to the rescue. In today's video, we will take you through what these node services are, how they come in, and what you would benefit from using them. Stay tuned! Before we dive in, let us remind you that the information available in this video is for educational purposes only. We are not financial advisors, and this is not financial advice. Be sure to do your own research before investing in any asset. Hey guys! Welcome to the first video of our channel! If you are someone interested in the crypto space, make sure to subscribe to the channel for regular informative videos on everything around crypto, including new projects, complex concepts, and a lot more. Now let's get started. Now let's talk about nodes as a service. First, what are nodes? As mentioned briefly in the intro, nodes store a complete copy of the distributed ledger. They are used by developers to build blockchain-based applications. Each node can store a complete copy of the distributed ledger. With this, any user can access the data and can view all transactions conducted or stored on the network. Launching a network node used to be practically the only way to connect to the blockchain. Each new node contributes to the decentralization of the blockchain network, shortening the transaction time and reducing fees. By setting up your node, you receive a small income from the transactions that go through your channels. Nodes also participate in consensus, share information about transactions and the number of funds, confirm transactions, and store copies of confirmations, participate in the building of new blocks in the chain, for which they receive a reward. A business using nodes is built on receiving commissions for transfers, purchase and sale of cryptocurrency assets on the exchange. Next, how do you deploy a node? A number of requirements must be taken into account when thinking of developing a full node. Before starting to deploy a node, you must verify the minimum hardware requirements. This may be different depending on the crypto coin you are using. To deploy a full Bitcoin node, for instance, your device must have the latest version of Windows, Mac OS X, or Linux, 500 gigabytes or more of free disk space available with a minimum read speed of 100 megabytes a second, and an SSD capable of performing 68 megabytes a second random write and 30.9 megabytes a second random read with at least 112 gigabyte capacity and at least 8 gigabytes of RAM. You would also need a broadband internet connection with a download speed of at least 50 kilobytes per second, unlimited connection, and high upload limits. Deploying your own node also requires administrative skills. You are also solely responsible for ensuring the security of your node because, well, internet hackers don't take a day off. All of these can be overwhelming, and you may be faced with frustrating roadblocks such as limited network bandwidth or a slowdown of normal network traffic when deploying a node on your business network. In all, this process can be overbearing and leave you little or no time to invest in your business. And this is where Nodes as a Service saves the day. For the next few minutes, we will talk about this lifesaver in the world of blockchain technology. Nodes as a Service takes away the entire burden of deploying your node yourself, giving you ample time to focus on other important aspects of your business. There are several companies that offer this service, including Infura, GetBlock, and Alchemy. These node service providers deploy the core resources and use the necessary technologies and infrastructure to set up and maintain the nodes connected to the blockchain. Depending on the needs of your business, the node service provider can provide access to the networks of Bitcoin, Ethereum, Monero, Litecoin, and others. The provider assumes responsibility for all actions related to the node. For the client, the node provider is a means of entering and exiting the blockchain at any time. 
Some services offer you your own dedicated node that they manage for you, while others use load balancers to distribute activity across nodes. Almost all node services are extremely easy to integrate with, involving one-line changes in your code to swap out your self-hosted node or even switch between the services themselves. Important to note, however, is the node services do not and should not store your private keys or information. The downside of this technique is that you hand over the control of your business infrastructure to a third party. By using a node service, you are centralizing the infrastructure aspect of your product. For this reason, projects that hold decentralization to the utmost importance might prefer self-hosting nodes rather than outsourcing to a third party. That's all about nodes as a service. We hope you found this helpful. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and check out all our other amazing content. Talk to you soon.